Just a quick personal insight today on great leadership. And I think certainly what I found most interesting is I've really dialed back into political leadership, uh, having kind of done my best to stop paying attention to it with the, the real sort of polemic quality of um, you know, sort of leadership at a political level that we've seen on the global stage over the last couple of years. And uh, yeah, I, I, I've certainly personally been focusing much more at organisational, um, you know, sort of leadership. But what this crisis has done, I think, is really help show, you know, sort of the quality of uh, leadership, you know, at the, at the most, you know, sort of senior level, you know, people who are leading countries and, uh, and, and large portions of countries at a state level, you know, and I think leaders are showing their true colours as they are, you know, sort of at the cafe level, even though they can't meet in cafes, and at the organisational level. Um, you know, and, and I've seen this, you know, sort of within within my own team for sure. You know, sort of people are really behaving as they truly are at the moment. So I think, you know, it's, it's been, it's been uh, you know, sort of reassuring and inspiring in a way for me to, to actually, um, you know, look at leaders like these three that I've been talking about all week, Jacinda Ardern, Gavin Newsom, and Li Xiang Long of Singapore, whose name I'm sure I'll become more competent with by the end of the week. Um, yeah, it, it's it's good to see these great leaders really sort of stepping forward and being celebrated as doing so. Yeah, you know, celebrated for stepping forward and for being the leaders that we really need to see a lot more of and from. Um, and yeah, I think what I would say is I'm seeing the same, you know, within my clients and. And I'm, I'm hoping that, you know, as we emerge from the crisis, you know, in a couple of months ahead and we start to sort of, you know, figure out the way forward and, you know, what we've learned and what this experience has taught us and then how we deploy and use that learning moving forward, you know, can we be more empathetic? Can we be more consistent and transparent with our communication? And can we connect with the people that we lead on a much, much deeper level? I certainly hope so. Thank you. I'll see you again soon.